um, to to follow on to that, okay, um, you want to start taking note of some potential scams out there in the market. It's always there. It's always gonna be there. <laughs> Okay, and uh, I think depending on which country you're at, okay, some is more prominent, some is a little bit less prominent. Uh, in Malaysia, I can share with you, there's so many every year. When one goes down, when, go, when one of the scams busted, there will be a new one coming out again. And most of the time, they run in similar nature. Okay? So all you need to really do is to identify some of the red flags okay, and uh, just be careful, okay? Uh, in my couple of years in trading, being in this industry since 2012, uh, I've seen a lot, okay? Come and go. Uh, I've warned a couple of my friends. Um, some of them, of course, don't listen, but eventually, you know, they lose their entire investment on there. Um, yeah, but I can share with you what are some of the potential things you want to take note of, okay? Number one, okay? If an investment or a potential scheme comes to you and say that, oh, we're gonna promise you very high return, or I'm gonna guarantee you a fixed percentage return per month, uh, this is one of the potential red flag. Okay. Um, now, there is no such thing as guaranteed profits or guaranteed a fixed percentage return. Okay. Why? Because the financial market is always fluctuating. The financial market is always evolving. There's no way someone can always use that strategy and return, right? Profit every month similarly. Okay. So do take note of that, right? If there's a scheme or an investment scheme comes to you and say that, oh, every month guarantee you 5%, okay? Do take note, right? Be aware, ah, maybe it's a potential red flag. Now, second thing that you want to take note of is if today the strategy or the investment scheme is sharing with you or telling you right every month we can make about 10 to 20 percent okay now in in fx trading can you do that yes but not every month maybe there will be a very good month or a couple of good months that you can really yield maybe 10 percent okay i've enjoyed that before but not every month Okay. And you also need to take note, if today I want to make 10 to 20% every month, I need to take a very high risk in order to achieve that kind of return. And what did we talk about risk just now? We say, if today you can make 10 to 20% per month, but if you lose 50% of your capital, what's the point of it, right? It, eventually, you need a lot of more effort just to break even. Okay, So do take note of that. It's possible. But if they do it consistently every month, you know it's high risk okay and um if someone is selling you there's a no loss showing system uh, definitely you can walk away right high chance is a potential scam okay so um hopefully you 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 get some of these points that i talk about because if today you are new you want to get started in trading uh these are things that i feel no one in the industry really talks about uh, or emphasize enough to actually guide and help uh, newer traders, right? So this is something that I think, uh, hopefully you take it seriously enough to protect yourself, okay? <laughs> now, um, often you will also see what we call brokers as money gain, okay? Um, one way to do it is the broker themselves um, outright is the scheme, okay? Uh, the other way is the brokers actually work together with another group of people uh, to make it a little bit more difficult to to kind of identify them as money game, okay, or scam, okay. Um, so you need to take note of a few things over here, um, because as I mentioned, right, it's easy to set up and register as a broker, okay, and it's also very easy to actually set up a backend, right. A lot of people think, whoa, MT4, MT5, uh, to to actually get a license is very is very difficult. Um, in today's context, it's not. Okay, uh, with let's say a fifty thousand um, dollars capital, you can get the entire thing set up. Okay, and fifty thousand dollars, if your objective is to run a scam, a money game, it's small amount, right? Because when they when they eventually run away with money, is in the millions, right? So fifty thousand to them is nothing. Okay, so you need to understand um, because it's so easy to do all this, it's also very easy for them to fabricate stuff. Right? So 
it's easy for any organization to come in and say that oh we have a broker and because it's so easy to set up the back end of mt4 and mt5 uh, they can fabricate trading activities okay uh, so what some of the potential thing you need to take note of is uh, when someone just show you their mt4 account and you know you let you start to look at it they start to show wow every trade is profit okay um just know that it can be fabricated right it can be back end um they can actually change it certain things and and just to have that history of all profit okay um the other one that you know some of my friends share with me is uh they realize that when they start to compare the the different brokers mt4 they realize that the price movement is very different okay um again you know all this is not so easily identified for someone who is new uh but coming from my experience some of my friends experience who share with me all these things that's happening um i just want to highlight so that you're aware of the possibility of all this happening okay in this market Okay, so red flags again, um, if today you're seeing someone introducing to you, you know, um, come into the FX market, uh, you can make a lot of money and, and things like that, uh, be careful, okay? Uh, if you start to see like, well, there's high commissions and rebates for referral through some kind of money, uh, multi-level marketing approach, be careful, okay? Um, lacking of transparency in trading activities also be careful right some of the uh, brokers would say oh you can't see the trade until the trade is closed okay. that doesn't make sense right um so yeah so take note of all these things